How y'all doing? Hey, you ought to know me and Buck by now. Me and old Buck, we race dirt track races. Uh, we sell stuff on TV. We're plumbers. We go out and do plumbing, but we sell stuff on TV. The reason we sell stuff on TV is because we try it first. If we like it, we sell it. People seem to trust our opinion on shit. Well, anyway, I had this other product. Actually, it came to me. Some guys came to the front door and they said, hey, we got this new security system alarm, you know, for your house. And I said, well, what's it do? They told me if anybody breaks in, it'll let everybody know that they're here. I thought, well, the only person really knows know that they're here would be me, but I figured maybe, you know, we'll try it out. And I said, well, if I try this out and I like it, do I get it for free? And they said, yeah. Oh, but what do you think? And try this new security system out? So they got it all put in. And got it all set up, and uh, Buck went over there, and they went over it with him. He's like, I, I, I don't want to mess with that shit. Well, anyway, they, old Buck, he gave him some number, you know, to punch in in case it, you know, goes wrong. He, that's a code number, I guess. Buck told me all this after he got through doing it. And then uh, he had to have a, a password. We you know, old Buck gave him a password. So they left, you know, and this, me and Buck were checking it out. You know, on the first day, when you open all the doors in the house, it constantly tells you that there's a door open. That thing ain't on, it just tells you. Well, after about three days of that, that got kind of old humbug. I mean, ain't nothing worse than somebody telling you your door's open when you're the one that fucking opened it. I opened the door and closed the door. And they always say, a front door open, back door open, side door open, garage door open. Hell, I don't need to be reminded of what I just fucking opened. Anyway, that got kind of annoying after about three days. I told Buck, I said, it's getting old. Well, anyway, uh, I was messing with it here yesterday, and uh, and old Buck, he come walking through the door when I had the damn thing set, and uh, it went off, and it started going, you know, beep, 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 and it said right on there, and I said, Buck, what do I do? Buck said, you got 30 minutes to shut it off. I said, well, Buck, it wants, it's asking for, a, it's asking for a code number, Buck, and old Buck, he said, I had the number. I said, well, punch it in before you run out of time. And old Buck couldn't remember the number. About that time, ran out of time. This son of a bitch went down to, I don't know, half a minute, and then it started squealing and screaming, and oh my god, it was the awfulest god no noise you ever heard. I said, Buck, how do you turn this piece of shit off? I mean, the dogs were going nuts, everybody was going nuts, I was going nuts. I took it off the wall, I looked at it, and it started talking to me. It said, who are you? I said, what? It said, who are you? I said, Buck, the goddamn thing's talking to me. He said, who are you? Why are you in this house? I said, that's none of your goddamn business. This is my house. They asked me what my name was. I said, they ain't none of your damn business. They asked me, he said, what's your address? I said, that's my problem, too. And then, all of a sudden, she just said, oh, no, this is the mic. This is the thing talking to me. I was, like, holding it up here like this, and it's talking to me. I said, oh, damn, it wasn't even, I don't think it's a telephone, but it was talking to me. So anyway, it, it quit talking. It just quit talking and started making all kinds of noise. So I threw it down. I said, Buck, let's get out front until we can figure out how to shut this thing off, seeing how you don't remember nothing. God damn, Buck, piss me off sometimes. We got out front, lo and behold, two police cars, one sheriff and a highway patrol, and they were about 15 foot away with their guns drawn, aiming right at me and Buck. And they told me and Buck, they said, freeze. I'm not sure what that meant, but I just stood still. I looked over at Buck, I said, Buck, don't move. I said, Buck, if there's any chance in the world you can remember that, you know, code number or password right now, that would be a good time to come up with it. Oh, shit. That old Buck, he shit his pants. I, I thought she was more of a man. He stood there and shit his pants when he seen that gun drawn down on him. Not only could he not remember the code, he couldn't remember the numbers or the password. He shit himself. Then they came over and frisked us. Well, they frisked me. They started to frisk old Buck. Whew, he's pretty rank. He shits your pants, Buck. My God. Grow up, man. Anyway, they found out it was our house and blah, blah, blah. And Buck finally got to go back in the house and clean his shorts out. And uh, anyway, I called that company and told them, said, you know, it's a piece of shit. It tells you every time you go out the door. It dings every time you go out the door. And if you fuck up and give somebody like Buck your security number or password and you don't fucking remember it, then all hell breaks loose. So I don't really need one of them. You know, I got a, I got a dog in the backyard. I'm just going to buy me another dumb dog that barks a lot.
feed him some shit and just say, hey, take care of my house. And nobody ever comes around here anyway. I don't know why I bought it. I didn't really buy it, but it got to where I, I don't think you need one of those. So I think a good old rifle or shotgun will take care of anybody breaking in. Of course, they say if you shoot somebody in your house, now they can see you and take all the shit that you own, used to own. But anyway, I'm going to have to talk to Buck here because I'm going to straighten his ass out. Anyway, you come watch 2C shit and uh, come watch my videos. And we're not going to sell this product because all uh, people would put them in their house and think of me and they'd, they'd look at me and just piss them off. So uh, we don't want to do that. So I'll see y'all later. Hey, bud.